welcome all the students to the video lecture on security tips for using atm on the particular topic automated teller machine this is my fourth lecture at the outset in my first lecture i explained the meaning of atm and the structure of atm in the second lecture i explained various types of atm in the third lecture i explained the frauds which are associated with the atm transactions that is atm skimming and card cloning and in this fourth lecture i will try to explain some basic security tips one should keep in mind while performing our transactions at atm points or while performing transactions using various bank cards so let us try to understand let us try to learn what are the security tips for using atm the very first important security tip one should keep in mind that is about pin number every atm card holder will get four digit pin number after entering that particular pin number we are in a position to perform our transactions at atm machines and at point of sales terminal devices so one thing we should keep in mind that never disclose your pin number with anybody don't write down your pin number at any place on any paper in any diary or anywhere try to memorize your pin number it is very easy to memorize that particular pin number which has been issued by bank and frequently try to change that given pin number the most important thing here to remember is don't write down your pin number at the reverse of your or the back side of your atm card people what they do in order to get easy access of the pin number most of the people try to write down their pin number at the reverse side of the atm so that they can easily get the access while performing the transaction but try to avoid not try to avoid definitely avoid this particular practice because when you lose your card along with your card you will also provide your pin number to the person who will get that particular card who will find that particular card so whoever will find you whoever will get your lost card he will be easy it will be easy for him along with your atm card he ready made he will get your pin number and he will use he can use that particular card and your pin to withdraw the money from your account so keep in mind never disclose your pin number and never write down your pin number at any place the second important tip is about use atms which are situated in bank bank branch itself or use such atms which are situated at nearby bank premises because frequently people used to visit these locations frequently the bank customers and other people do their transactions perform their transactions at such places so therefore preferably use those atms which are situated in bank branch or which are situated nearby the bank premises because apart from the customers and other people 
the bank employees they also do visit frequently to such atm machines so therefore use those atm machines then the next security tip is about avoid atms at isolated places isolated places means such places where there is less traffic where the less crowd at such places avoid visiting such places for performing any transactions avoid visiting to such atms it might be a possibility that the frauders might tamper that particular atm machine because of the geographical location because the atm is isolated no at not at public place no crowd of people is was over there so therefore it might be a possibility that frauders might tamper that atm machine so therefore try to avoid the atms try to avoid at that atm places which are very isolated from the public places and next security tips is tip is about card reader in my earlier lecture i explained how the frauders will tamper the atm machine how the frauders will install the pin hole camera how the frauders tamper the original card reader of atm machine in detail i explained this particular process in my earlier lecture so whenever you enter into the atm point try to observe that particular place particularly try to observe the original situation or position of original card reader see whether the slot of that card reader is fixed or it is loose try to observe the light which blinks over there whether that light blinks very naturally try to observe that it is not tampered by anyone try to observe the wiring mechanism and setup of that particular card reader if you find the card reader is loose then don't insert your card into the card reader if you find some uh structure or the mechanism of that card reader is unfamiliar so don't try to insert your atm card in that particular slot of card reader so in this way observe the atm machine very keenly before performing your transaction the next security tip is observe atm site observe atm site means when you enter at the atm point observe that particular machine observe that everything is familiar everything and every part of the machine is at the same place observe that the security camera which is situated at a particular place is at the right place observe that the people around you try to observe the body language of the people while entering your pin number observe that the pin pad or the number pad is original try to look at the lights try to look at the lights which blink over there at particular places they are blinking in a right position in a right manner so that you will get an idea about that particular uh, premises so therefore before performing your transaction try to observe that particular site who are the people wandering nearby what they are doing what 
the structure of the machine how the structure of the machine is looking like whether all the parts of the machine are perfectly well they are perfectly uh, organized in a proper manner so try to observe each and everything it is the important security tip while performing transactions at atm sites the next tip is preferably use the atm machines with whom you are familiar with preferably use those machines where you frequently visit to perform your transactions because you will get familiar with that particular machine if somebody uh, tampers if somebody do any uh, tampering activity with the instruments then easily you will get acquainted with that particular activity because frequently you used to handle that particular machine you will uh, aware with each and every part of that particular machine you get acquainted each and every part of that particular machine so someone if someone tampers then easily you will recognize that particular changes in the uh, structure of the machine changes in the uh, setup of the machine so frequently use familiar atms this is the another tip next point is shield your hand while entering your pin while entering your pin your code uh, try to protect or try to shield your hand over that particular pin pad so that to so that to avoid some hidden devices to record your pin entering activities in yesterday's lecture we uh, we studied in earlier lecture we studied how the frauders will install will put the pin hole hidden cameras to record your pin entering activity so in order to avoid that thing shield your hand while entering your pin on pin pad or number pad the next tip is register for sms alerts means register your mobile number with your bank account so that you will get the alerts of every activity you perform after withdrawing the money you will get sms after depositing the money you will get sms or after performing any of the bank activity you will get sms alerts so that register your mobile number your registered mobile number with your bank account it will give each and every alert uh, on your mobile phone the next tip is keep transaction slips after performing the transaction at atm point the printed slip will come out of that machine so try to keep that printed slip for one week or some one or two days with you because most of the times what happens we do get the slip we observe and we tear it out and we put it into the dustbin so whenever our transaction get fails and when we get the printed slip after some time we will came to know that our amount of money is debited from our bank so to keep the records or to give some inputs to the bank officials regarding the failed transactions or some other transactions try to keep the transactional slips for certain days after performing the transactions and the last tip here i would like to mention check account balance frequently frequently means at some intervals a uh, check your account balance so that you will be uh, get the information about your account so in this way these are some security tips 
which are very helpful and useful for performing ATM transactions in this particular lecture. I will stop here. Thank you. Thank you.